Hello IG Garage family. So, if you're seeing the P0155 code on your scanner, you're dealing with an issue in the oxygen sensor heater circuit for Bank 2 Sensor 1. This might sound technical, but honestly, it's something you can fix. In today's video, we're breaking down what P0155 means, where this crucial oxygen sensor is located, and how you can diagnose and fix the issue to get your car running smoothly again. Stick with us till the end, and let's dive into the details. The P0155 code indicates a malfunction with the oxygen sensor heater circuit in the Bank 2, Sensor 1 location. The oxygen sensor has a heating element that warms it up to operating temperature quickly, ensuring that the readings it sends to the engine control unit or ECU are accurate. Without this heater, the sensor just can't function properly, especially during cold starts. When this heater circuit fails, your engine's ECU will throw the P0155 code, and you might experience rough starts, poor fuel efficiency, or just an overall lack of performance. This can lead to incorrect air-fuel mixtures, resulting in inefficient combustion and increased emissions. Symptoms of P0155 include check engine light, poor fuel efficiency, rough or hard engine start, increased emissions and sluggish acceleration. Common causes of P0155 are, first, a faulty oxygen sensor heater which is honestly the most common cause of this code, a malfunctioning heater element inside the oxygen sensor itself. Second, wiring issues. If there's damage or corrosion in the wiring that connects the heater to the ECU, the heater just won't get the power it needs to operate. Third, a blown fuse. A blown fuse in the heater circuit could prevent the sensor from receiving power. And finally, corroded connectors. A corroded or loose connector can prevent proper voltage from reaching the heater element. Bank 2 refers to the side of the engine that does not have cylinder number 1. Sensor 1 is located before the catalytic converter, typically on the exhaust manifold or along the exhaust pipe leaving the engine. This sensor detects the amount of oxygen in the exhaust gases before they pass through the catalytic converter. It's critical for ensuring your engine runs efficiently and within emission standards. The oxygen sensor heater is embedded within the sensor itself and is powered by the vehicle's electrical system. The heating circuit is connected to the sensor's electrical connector, which is typically located on the wiring harness near the sensor. If you have access to the wiring diagram, you can trace the heater circuit back to the fuse box to see if there's an issue with the power supply. Start by checking the wiring and connector of the oxygen sensor for any visible damage corrosion or looseness. Any of these issues could interrupt the power supply to the heater circuit, triggering the P0155 code. Okay, so first let's test the heater circuit. You'll want to use a multimeter to check the heater circuit voltage at the sensor's electrical connector. If you don't see the proper voltage, which is usually around 12 volts, then the heater element might be faulty. But if the voltage looks good, go ahead and test the wiring and connector to make sure they're supplying the necessary power. Now don't forget to check the fuse. Take a look in the fuse box for a blown fuse that controls the oxygen sensor's heater circuit. If you find a blown fuse, just replace it with a new one of the same rating. Next up, if the heater element inside the oxygen sensor is faulty, you're going to need to replace the sensor. Make sure you use an OEM, or Original Equipment Manufacturer sensor, or at least a high-quality aftermarket option so you get the right compatibility and performance. After you've replaced or fixed the heater circuit, grab your OBD2 scanner and clear the P0155 code. Then, take your vehicle for a test drive to make sure the check engine light stays off and the engine is running at its best. And that's how you fix the P0155 code and get your oxygen sensor heater circuit working again. By taking care of this issue, your engine's gonna run more efficiently, plus you'll improve your fuel economy and cut down on those harmful emissions. If this video helped, make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell for more car repair tips from IG Garage. Also check out these related videos for more O2 sensor fixes. First, P0063, MAP or MAF sensor range or performance issue, and second, P0064, MAP or MAF sensor circuit high voltage. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time on IG Garage. Keep your engine running smooth and stay safe on the road.